Hi guys, today we're going to talk about Meghan Markle and Sofia of Sweden. If you don't know who Sofia of Sweden is, she's a princess and uh, she's in the royal family by way of marrying Carl Philip of Sweden, who is the youngest son of the future queen of Sweden. And Sofia of Sweden, who is not an aristocrat, she comes from a very humble background. She did some studies in accounting prior to uh, getting married and uh, entering the royal family. So she was um, interviewed regarding her life. She got to talk about herself and how difficult it had been at times and the fact that she lost her own identity in a way. Now came the question of mixit. I'm not sure why I'm saying mixit because I hate that word but some people do like to uh, to say it just to piss Meghan Markle off as if she cared. So she was asked if she could have done something like Meghan Markle and Prince Harry, which means deciding not to be working royals and just moving to another country to have a private life. And what she said is that, well, she couldn't do that or she cannot do that because she's given the freedom to have a private life. She has the best of both worlds. That's what she said. She said that not only she's a working royal, but at the same time, she has her own private life that is never reported in the newspaper, which is a major difference between her situation and Meghan Markle. Markle situation. Meghan Markle didn't breathe a day without hearing about her past, hearing about her life, hearing about what's going on in the palace. Don't you think that there is drama happening in the Swedish crown? There is drama happening in the Swedish crown. We just don't get to know about it because the press there, the media are not after the royals. They're not going at them. They're not attacking them. The media in the UK have decided that Meghan Markle will be not only their cash cow, but she's going to be their victim. So they go at it when they can't find any drama they invent, which is what is not happening with, with Sofia of Sweden. Now, the fact that she said that she couldn't do that, people or the media and the hater has been spreading the word that she was dissing Meghan Markle. She never dissed Meghan Markle. She just said that she has more freedom than what Meghan Markle had when she joined the royal family. She had a private life, which Meghan Markle did didn't have. Everything was in the press and when they could not find something to tell, they would invent. Going back to the fact that she was left alone, people say that we can't compare Meghan Markle and Sophia of Sweden because Sophia of Sweden is class, is pure class, she's not trash, she doesn't have the same fractured family, the same background as a Meghan Markle. At one point I was like, hello, are you kidding me? Do you know what she did before she married? When I say she, I'm talking about Sophia of Sweden. Did before she married the Prince of, of Sweden? Well, let me remind you of that. I'm not trying to diss her or put her down, but if you want to compare Meghan Markle to Sophia of Sweden, compare both past, it's fair that you actually present the facts. I'm going to present the facts to you. Before she married into the royal family, Sophia of Sweden participated to many reality shows and in one of them she introduced one of the participants and they allegedly had sex in that TV show. It was like a big brother type of reality show and she did have sex with a participant in that show. On top of that, when she, she left sometimes before she got married to go to New York to work as a model, she went to New York and because she couldn't find work as a model there, she had to work as a stripper. She did work for a few months as a stripper in Las Vegas and New York City, allegedly. Not only that, she had worked as well as an escort. Now, let's go back to uh, Meghan Markle's past. So people keep telling us that Meghan Markle has secrets, she's done something, she was a yacht girl. Nowhere could we find any proof of her yachting. No photos, nothing, no trace, nothing. Whereas we can find traces for what I just said before. And also, Meghan Markle, she's never done any strip work anywhere in the US. The only thing she, she did was to be a uh, brief girl in that uh, TV show. So you can't compare, you can't call Meghan Markle trash when she hasn't done anything wrong. And But when you check the background of Sofia of Sweden, she would definitely had a past and not a glorious one. Her husband said that he knew of her past and he accepted it, which is fine. So the reason why Sofia doesn't want to run away from Sweden is because people leave her alone and also because nobody goes to look into her past and to plaster it in the media, the newspapers, at the front page of the newspapers every single day like what's happening with Meghan Markle. If Meghan Markle hasn't done half of what she did in her past. That's what I wanted to say. So if you like the story, feel free to click on like, subscribe for more videos and click on the notification bell to be notified when I post a new video. Thank you.